am thrilled to be here because y'all energize me. This is awesome, and I feel younger again. I've been at EY 33 years, so I would be the old fire in the room, so thank you, thank you, thank you for energizing me. As Mike mentioned, there are three big things that I want to share with you tonight. The incredible hot startup scene in Denton, wow, Denton, women business pioneers, and thirdly, the shift from the garage to downtown. So in Texas, we've always talked about sports heroes, whether they're on the football field, the baseball field, the basketball court, or the ice rink. Our heroes now in Dallas are you guys. You guys and gals, the Texas entrepreneurs, are the homegrown heroes of Texas, and we cannot thank you enough. Because of you, this is one of the best places to live, work, and play. So thank you, thank you, thank you. So first off, first off, let's talk about Denton's hot, 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 hot startup scene. There is no stronger term than hot. We know about hot, especially August in Texas. But these days, the hottest ticket has got to be Denton. The fact is that Denton has cooked up more homegrown entrepreneurs, artists, musicians, and they're creating a hub for startup talent and innovation. In fact, Denton has surpassed Travis County, AKA Austin, as the number six on the list of the 25 best places to find a high tech job. Big time in Dallas. There's been over 77 meetups, including the first Startup Weekend Dallas, uh, Denton, excuse me, Open Coffee Club Denton, Open Hack Denton, Denton Jelly, and so many more. And what you have coming together is an ecosystem of nonprofit organizations, co-working space, tech mail, and others serving to make Denton a huge startup hub. Starting first in a coffee shop called Banter and moving recently into a new space called Square 205, there is so much planned for expansion in Denton. So if you're a real estate investor, head north. Denton's where it's at. Now we also have two leaders today that I believe are here, Kyle Taylor and Carissa Redwine. Are y'all here? Woo! Great to be here. These guys are the creators of the weekly startup digest that goes out every Monday, and many of you probably get it. It's a weekly digest that's promoted over 970 events, has a community of 1,700 subscribers, it's gone, been going out for 45 weeks. I'm a CPA, that's a lot of math. They've sent out over 77,000 emails in 2014. That's congratulations. <laughs> But it's also the officials of Dallas, um, the, uh, excuse me, the officials of Denton. Denton's where it's at. Dallas is doing well too, but Denton's where it's at. <laughs> Denton is a story that all North Texas can emulate. So all of us can learn from the way they've brought together their economic development office, the University of North Texas's Greenhouse Innovation Center, and other technology advocates have come together in the city. And the city put in $220,000 into a downtown Denton technology initiative. So it is hot and happening in Denton. You guys got to go there. Okay, our second story is about the better half of entrepreneurs, and that would be the women. <laughs>